7 Action News reporter Allie Hoxie is joining us live now to break down why these schools are asking for help from the community. Allie. Yeah, that's right. I'm live outside the Dearborn School District. They're asking for a bond along with several other schools in our area. The more I dug into this, the more I found out a lot of these schools are asking for this money to help with infrastructure issues and aging buildings. The highest bond ask is at the Ann Arbor Public School System. They're asking for a billion dollars. I'm still undecided. I, I don't know. My reservations are that it is a great deal of money. Voters I spoke to in Ann Arbor say they're on the fence about voting for a billion dollar bond for the Ann Arbor school system. We're taking care of like, you know, the buildings, but not the teachers in the buildings. So I support them. But on the other hand, people have talked about how this, the school buildings are falling apart. Michigan is one of 12 states that does not fund at the state level for physical properties. Superintendent Janice Kerr-Swift says updates are needed to the buildings, including upping security. If passed, more cameras would be added and vestibules would be added to all the school entryways with windows from the front office to see who wants to gain access. The uh, person arriving is there in uh, a safe and secure place out of the weather, but also is able to undergo, um, you know, an entry process. Ann Arbor Schools is not alone in asking for additional funding this election. Dearborn Schools are asking voters to approve a $240 million bond. The school district says the money is needed for building repairs and updates and to increase security. Novi Schools are asking for a $185 million bond for building improvements and technology improvements. If passed, Meadows Elementary School would be expanded, buses would be purchased, and an activity center would be built. Brighton schools are asking for a $59.4 million bond. They say it's needed for building improvements, including adding a new maintenance building and robotics building to the high school. Lakeview schools is asking for a $54 million bond. The proposed bond would address safety and security concerns, including cameras and monitoring systems, classroom door emergency locks, emergency alert systems, and new layouts for many of the district's parking lots. For Ralph Katz of Ann Arbor, he says a building billion dollars might seem like too much for some, but he plans to vote yes. A billion dollars seems like a lot, but you divide that over 100,000 people and over a number of years, and it's not that much a year. 